Annyeong! This is your Korean study buddy Sunny. Today we will learn expressions about cats such as 집사, 감자, and 개냥이. By the end of this video, you can use these new expressions. Let's get started with the first expression. Our first word is 집사, meaning a butler. However, in this context, 집사 refers to a person who has a cat because the person do lots of chores for a cat, like a butler. Additionally, there is the verb 간택되다, commonly used with 집사. 간택되다 means that someone is chosen as a spouse for royalty. That's why you can hear this word often from historical K-dramas. Here is an example of the expressions including 집사 and 간택되다. If your Korean friend says, 나 길냥이한테 집사로 간택됐어. It means that an alley cat likes your friends, so your friend decided to adopt the cat. Our second expression is 감자를 캐다. This sentence consists of three parts. 감자, meaning a potato, 를, which is an object marker, and the verb 캐다 is to take out. So the whole sentence literally translates to to dig out potatoes. However, in the context of a cat, a potato refers to a solid clump, which is a cat litter sand. That's why 감자를 캐다 means to scoop out the solid litter from the cat litter box. Let's look at an example of the expression. If you ask your Korean friend what they are going, and your friend says, 우리 집 고양이 감자 캐고 있어. It means that I'm scooping out the my cat's soiled litter. Let's move on to the next expressions. Our last word is 개냥이. It is an informal way of saying a puppy like cat. As you can see, this expression is a combination of 개, meaning a dog, and 냥이, which is a slang for 고양이 meaning a cat. This marks the end of today's video. If you have found this video interesting, don't hesitate to hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Annyeong!